<clears throat> Hello. It is, uh, it's Friday now, right? Yeah, it is Friday. And that means I'm getting the new ML5 today. Brand new right here. Fuck. See Dom? Yeah, okay. I need Dominial imprints, actually. Uh, because I recalled her. And I was given the opportunity. I haven't gotten many copies since then. Oh, that's Helicopium, though. <laughs> Honestly, I want the Whale Shop opened again. I spent all my coins on Blood Moon Haste, back when Maid Chloe was meta. <laughs> it's okay. I've I got good use out of him when I did use him. So that's nice, at the very least. Uh, wait. I need to do one swap. I have 48k gold. We're running a little bit low, so this kind of is painful for me. Look at that SF. Over half of my net worth gone for this guild war. <laughs> no, uh, it's okay. We got Rin here because the Soul Weaver doesn't matter. And then we got Huayan to just... She's gonna step on everybody. Hmm. Yep. Uh, that's the game plan. And then, Rebecca. I'm gonna keep Lunaing people until it fails. I think is how this is gonna go down. And it hasn't failed yet, so we're going to keep Lunaing people. Uh, yep. That's all there is for strategy there. She's kind of fast. Alright, what do we get? What do we get? What do we get? Have we got defense buff? That's actually pretty good. <laughs> he got crit damage. Crit rate. <laughs> for our pilot stuff. I think that's good. We obviously can't kill anything with this. That's okay. Okay, this can't actually provoke the maid. Uh, I'm just gonna S1 this healing. Although it is injury bellion, I should probably hit the bellion. Hmm. This can also strip. Wait, or should I kill this? That has a revive on it. Yeah, but if I kill it... Alright, alright, I gotta kill this, actually. I know I've switched targets, like, three times here, but it's for the greater good. Uh... And then, we get a Rin S3 again. Alright, what does the casino give us this time? Surely Gab on the Huayun. Yep. <laughs> what? Resistance! Futile. Spellion hasn't encountered in anything this whole time. It's pretty great, honestly. She isn't pro okay, this is the first time she's proc all matched, though. It's like, can I even complain? Not really. I did lose my crit damage, crit rate buff. 
on the pilots. It's unfortunate. I wonder if they're Hoyang's on the new Teyu artifact. He's on alligators? What? Impossible. Alright, so we might lose Bizarre here. Uh, which is unfortunate because they do have this defense again. And then again, I think. But it's okay, we'll hit. I mean, the air RV had a lot of speed on her, so it should be okay. Crimson Seed. Why are they all on Crimson Seed? It's like the worst artifact even in RTA these days. Oh no, man. What the fuck, my Luna? Forty K damage, not bad. <laughs> okay. Uh, we have successfully looted another A Rabi. It's a good day so far. Mm hmm And we got a Rin offensive. Wait, maybe we can do a triple Rin guild war. Uh maybe. We'll see. I'm not gonna like full on int with the Rin, but you know. If they're inting enough with their defenses, I might be able to pull it off. Okay, onto the Dalberg Fortress. Ah, unfortunate. I put the wrong Grass Soul Weaver in here, but it is the right Grass Soul Weaver for specifically right here because uh, I don't think Green can out heal that. I'm pretty sure she'd just die to the Mercedes, unfortunately. It's okay. We have the uh, Faya in to step on everything again. I think. The RV might be okay too, but. <clears throat> Hawaiian? Probably better. And then we're just going to Luna their ARV again. And again. And again. Even after it fails, I'll probably just keep doing it anyways. I, I don't know if I should have. Oh, wait, I have no option. I, I can't uh, switch the artifact. <laughs> I only have. 23k gold? I guess 24k gold pretty much. But 23k gold. So I can't swap artifacts. Unfortunate. I know. Hey, do we lose Bizarre this time? No. Hey, <laughs> he's hit Hoyang four times in a row if you include last guild war. Aw, oh, that's another Crimson Seed. Oh! Okay, my mouse double clicked. Thank god the AI is good. <laughs> I was close one. Hey, my Amelia. <laughs> not, not even close. <laughs> Whoa, that is a speed bellion?
Oh wait, this is actually kind of bad. If you're on, I could too. Oh wait, shit, that can proc the magic for friends. Alright, I think we're okay now. That's kind of sketchy though. Uh, I have this one here, actually. If it got the attack buff off, that would have been good. This will get the attack buff off. Counter attack. She didn't even crit. Alright, we should be good from here. Damn, that's a really fast injury, Valiana. Also, just be some extreme speed RNG. Yeah, but Rowana kind of shits on this, doesn't she? But maybe don't put counter attack on your Rowana, though, because she does counter. Uh, it can proc the magic for friends and the Mercedes. Like, I could have been screwed there if the magic for friends propped off of that counter attack from the Rowana. Because my Haoyang didn't have a barrier up. I mean, she might have survived still, honestly. I'm not too sure, though. I'm not, like, fully confident of her surviving there. Alright. You did another stepping on somebody. It's a great success. And we did another Luna in on someone. Also to great success. Mm-hmm. I look forward to our great success in the Bronze Mirror Fortress. Okay. Back to the round one strat. <laughs> uh, so, this could actually go terribly wrong. If Thiran is on R and L, and then he procs, and then kills my uh, Huayang. So I probably should ring a reviver here. But... Where's the fun in that? I guess winning is kind of fun. Hmm. That is a good point I bring up. I could also bring in Treno Kazuwazu here. And then just one tap her. But there's a problem with that strat. As you can see, he only has four pieces of gear. I guess is okay. Like, uh, Inferno Kazuwazu there. And then just immediately one tap there. Oh, and then I could... Shit. I did sell one piece of equipment to put... Uh, gear. Okay, look, look, look. I'm gonna do the Inferno Kazuwazu strap. You've done too much while you're me. I have to find a sword, though. And boots. I know an artifact, though. This new thing? Sphere Purification. Pretty good for him. Because the Rand's gonna S2, he's gonna get 10% CR, and then he's gonna get even more CR. It speeds at, uh, speeds at attack percent. Uh, I guess that works. It's a lot of crit damage. Speed. Do I have any good ones? Oh, that's actually a lot. Wait. Huh. I didn't know I had those laying around. 
Nice. Okay, and then we get Rin for the last unit. <laughs> of course. She'll be helping, I promise. But yeah, we just go in and one tap the Selene. Unless the Selene's like. Oh! Unless the Selene's faster than the Ran. <laughs> Which I guess is possible. But you get how much CR? 30% CR, so I don't think it should be a problem. And then I thought about it using a comp with like Dilovet here to knock the Landy out of stealth and then push my stuff forward. But I know for a fact I'm just gonna like 15% all of her debuffs and then Dilovet's not gonna frog. So we're not gonna go with that. We're just gonna do the exact same thing we've done every time into the Para. We're gonna Bissar, you know them. Uh, even if the Bissar is slower than the Hoyang, or it's like a hyperspeed landing that's faster than our Bissar, I'm pretty sure I win just because I doubt they're tanky enough to tank us. Uh, and they won't have a charge landy S3, so we're not dying to it, hopefully. Uh, yeah! Let's go! Let's go! I guess the uh the strat we don't want the uh Pylus. Because she doesn't really do much, does she? That's okay. We got Rin. I guess Pylus is defense buff and she had Arius on her. Oh wait, no she didn't. <laughs> that took off. Okay, we got Gab crit damage on her. Uh, I'll just go for this. Oh, it wasn't injury, Bellion. I don't think we're in much danger, to be fair. Get that gone. There we go. He resisted both! What's up with that? I think this one's on counter. Maybe. Maybe she's speed. That's a thing. I'm not gonna do this because I got blind. Delian's gonna proc us anyways here, right? Right? Oh, we got Gab. We got Gab. Gone. Oh. Gone. <laughs> Holy sacrifice. That's like a good tower prank. I don't know if I'd put that in a fort. Oh, we got the crit chance buff as well. <laughs> okay, yeah. Yeah, I kind of figured it was going to be a hyperspeed landy if you're running this. But does it matter? Well, that hurt, actually. How much does this heal for? Hopefully it gets us above half. Oh wait, I have souls, so I burn this for the heal. Like, I, I, surely I can one-shot through Escort. Oh wait, but Landy's a grass unit. I don't think I care about if she's a grass unit though. Like, yeah. I mean, why would I care? 
It's a skill difference. <laughs> See, I was right. It doesn't matter. The Landy was faster than the Bizarre. I'm pretty sure I said that. <laughs> I actually I hit the Landy. I've been stacking up a lot of RNG as of late. You know? Okay. Well. Hmm. I did say it could be a hyperspeed landy that just messes everything up. But she didn't mess everything up. So we were fine. Alright, so I used uh, Huayang in 2 out of 3 of my attacks today. Uh... Yep, she's busted, so you should use her in your attacks as well. Mm -hmm. It's very convincing points I'm making, I know. Uh, I don't think I used any of these. Maybe I should use Tamarin. Okay, Amelia is used in all three of the attacks because of the Luna. Oh, I scrolled past, didn't I? Yes. That same gear as last time. Still one shotting links with 99% crit rate. And I mod this to 6% crit chance. I have 5 of these crit damage ones for some reason. Oh, wait, this could be crit chance instead of flat attack, but I think the flat attack's better. But also, this is normally my LQC to next, so that's not getting swapped to flat attack. Uh, let's see here. I only use like five units today. Surely I can remember all of them. I used Rin twice, obviously because she's a powerful unit, not because my opponent's defenses suck. Uh, let's see here. Yep, yep. There's the Rin. Wait, I also used Rona. Ah, here's Rona. Good to get your uh, effectiveness and effect resistance uh, to the same number. So that way you can activate the secret uh, RNG uh, multiplier bonus. Uh, trust me, it's real. Inferno Kawazu on this artifact is pretty good to that type of stuff. Get into the Selene in general if you can get faster than her. But if you're not faster than her, uh, if you crit on her, right? And she's got like the possession buff up. Uh, she can counter you, right? And that'll dispel one of the burns. And then she can dust devil, and that'll dispel the other burns. And then you'll also likely be dead. Uh, so keep that in mind. I use the Pylos in all three of my attacks. Yep. Yeah. She would have been better on Arius for that last one. But I also waste, wanted to waste uh, 25k gold, so then I could end the video with only 4k gold. It's all a part of the strategy, really. Okay, and then the Tsar. That Landy was like the exact same speed as the Bizarre. Uh, maybe I got speed RNG. Maybe I was close to speed RNGing them. We'll never know because I won anyways, despite the speed RNG. <laughs> and maybe I should put Luna on symbol for that type of stuff. But I feel like if I had more accuracy on her, I wouldn't have hit because that would have been less RNG, and less RNG is bad, obviously. Alright, another obviously successful guild war through superior tactics than our opponents. Aha. Uh -huh. Alright. Good luck with your attacks. Goodbye. That wasn't very loud. Goodbye. <laughs>